Contour cutting is a process by which we isolate the perimeter of a printed graphic and then cut that perimeter, eliminating the excess material. You get a result just like this. software. It's very important. Every US cutter comes with SignCut Pro and Inkscape. Both are PC or Mac compatible and they're both really great, easy to use programs. This is Inkscape, my design and illustration application. The first thing to do here is to load our simple contour cut template. SignCut Pro comes with free templates with the proper alignment marks already present. All we have to do is place our art and create our contour cut line. You can see I've already loaded the template here. These are the alignment marks I was talking about. So we're going to place our graphic equilaterally, basically dead center. When we get into creating our contour cut line, we need to print our finalized art with crop marks in each corner. Let's go ahead and go up to File. Let's hit print. There's only a couple things you need to remember here. A, you select the correct printer. And B, check your preferences. Make sure there's no resizing or any kind of scaling going on with the final output to the printer. Make sure you've selected the proper orientation. And finally, make sure you've checked that the paper size option is set to the appropriate size according to the template you selected for your contour cut, in this case, letter. Hit OK and hit print. And that's all there is to it. We got our print art ready. Let's get it loaded into our contour cutter and let's start the process. Okay, there are more than a few ways to do this in Inkscape. I recommend researching different techniques to isolate a cut line. What I'm going to do is go ahead and start by having the image selected, coming up to Path, selecting Trace Bit. I'm going to use the Brightness Cutoff Filter. I recommend this filter. I'm going to use a threshold of 0.980. That's as close to a full point without completely being there. If you go to a full point, it'll black out the entire graphic and we won't be able to isolate anything. We're going to hit OK. We're going to go ahead and get rid of that screen. Now what we need to do is one other function. Because we really just want this perimeter shape cut out, we need to use, go back up to path, we need to use the break apart command. We're going to hit that. Now what that does is it separated our, our, our basically our perimeter cut line into shapes. And what we're going to do is we're going to grab that text here in the center that was like all the Quaker text. We're going to bring that away. I want to do one more little grab here, make sure we didn't miss anything. We'll select that, delete it. Now we've got a perfect contour cut line. We're going to take our print art and we're going to load it into our cutter. Before I do that, I'm going to mount it on a carrier sheet. This will just make the whole process easier. I'm using my laptop to actually control the movement of the laser as I'm talking. And there's our final sticker. Perfect die cut. There's our perfect contour cut. Thanks for learning the contour cut, and thanks for watching.